Today we are opening 50 rare Yu-Gi-Oh packs, searching for some of the coolest cards ever made. What's up guys, we are back with another 250k special video. Hopefully you've been enjoying the 250k special week. And don't forget there is more coming after today. So, you know, there's, there's just a lot. There's a lot of 250k happening so but before we continue into it we're going to mention the weekly giveaway which is the dark magician girl cgc 10 this is like a several hundred dollar card you guys can enter this by liking the video beat subscribe turn on notifications and i'm going to select one comment from the entire week that will win that card i'm also doing a giveaway specifically for this video a retro pack mini box all you have to do like the video be subscribed turn on notifications let me know down below what is your favorite thing you've seen from the 250k special? And what do you want to see at 300k? All right, so I have before us some really... Okay, there's a there's a, there's a pack trapped under here. What's going on? Are you okay, buddy? Buddy, we got to save him. Okay, we saved him. I'm going to miscount it then. There might be 51, but just your luck. We have Retro Pack, the new reprint set that everybody loves. So I grabbed a few of those. Ancient Prophecy for the Ghost Rares. Stardust Overdrive, a lot of amazing stuff. We've opened a lot of these in the past. The Duelist Genesis, first edition. Yeah, we've got four of those. So maybe... Maybe a ghost shirt potentially in there. We have a champion pack two right there and we have turbo pack six. You guys know what could be in here. The dark arm dragon ultimate rare. Oh wait, and that's not it. We've got a legacy of darkness and some labyrinth of nightmare. So this should be a pretty crazy video. So let's not waste any time. Let's get right to the retro pack. Retro pack time. Let's see what we can get. I don't remember the pack trade. I think it's four on retro pack, but oh, guy of the dragon champion starting us off hot. If you want to make sure your video has pulls in it, just open a few retro packs because they're like guaranteed to have pulls, basically. Okay, let's do a Stardust Overdrive because we have by far the most out of... Well, actually, we have 14 of these, so maybe we have similar as the Turbo Pack. But Turbo Pack's only three cards, so not as many cards from that one. Here we go. One, two, three from the back. Probably do Floppity Flip, but I'm just going to go for it for the first one. Herculean, Solitaire, Dark Spider. We've pulled a lot of great things out of this set, so let's hope we can continue that. Reptilian Gorgon, Mother Spider. Synchro Barry. Yeah, I think it is the floppity flip on that one. All right, let's do an Ancient Prophecy. We do have a few of these. Not a ton, but a few. I'm so excited about the 250K. Thank you guys again for 250K subscribers. One quarter of a million is really insane. I cannot believe we've made it. And uh, you know what? Let's, let's just hit that 300K goal soon. Like, let's just keep pushing that 300K goal. Because, I mean, that is pretty insane. Slip of Fortune. Pretty cool card. Dark Sea Float. Battle Teleportation. White Potent. Aegis of Ocean Dragon Lord. Quagmiru. The Jester Lord and Fishborg Blaster. We are started off a little bit slow. That's okay. We've got a lot of these, so I'm just going to go ahead and mix these in. These were actually prize packs, or not really prize packs, but like I think if you beat a Bounty Duelist, you got these or something. They've been doing that a lot recently at YCSs, so I did pick these up from somebody after they did that. Okay, it's going to be right at the beginning. Okay, because that's Stardust Dragon Rare, which I think it was probably worth a little bit. Golem Dragon and Fusion Gate. So it looks like the... The Dark Home Dragon would be right at the front, which is going to be a big jump scare when that happens. All right, Retro Pack. You know, actually, before we do, let's try to mix in a bunch of these because there are a lot of these. I'm going to try not to hit this mic, but it's kind of in my way sometimes. I'm so excited for more of these openings. Okay, we've got a uh, little little tag. This is not an error. Sometimes people ask me this if they got an error pack. That is just a, like, uh, it's, it was in the store or whatever, so they didn't want it to get stolen. Um... Yeah, but I'm excited for all these videos. The 250k every pack opening, especially. That is going to be a heck of a way to end the week. Enlightenment, we have Start of Zengel. Synchro Barrier. So only, only thing that's pulled something is Retro Pack. Not surprising, because Retro Pack never fails to pull something. Let's see if we can continue the luck. Let's do the pack trick. Let's do the pack trick. I was thinking about doing that, and then I was like, I can't decide. And then I was like, you know what? Let's do it. And it took me, I don't even know. Felt like a long time. Who knows? Probably like half a second in real life. We have Karibo. Regular rare. So, oh, even retro packs not playing anything. All right, back to Stardust Overdrive. I cannot wait to open those Duelist Genesis. I mean, ugh, come on. We opened 24 the other day. It didn't go that well. Like, we pulled one awesome card, but the rest of it was kind of... Mm, so, I kind of want to turn it around today, especially since these are my packs. <laughs> so, it could be pretty insane if we pulled something crazy. Quick draw Synchron. I'm going to pull that out. Uh, Roar. We have Relinquished, Level Eater, Spider Egg, Time Passage. Gemini Scorpion and Reptilian Scylla. Okay, let's go to another turbo pack. So right at the beginning, let's try not to spoil it right off the bat by going like this little reverse action like this. Not opening the easiest, I will say. Okay, yeah, there we go. Kind of ripped the pack a little bit. All right, let's do flippity. 
Flippity flop, floppity flip. We have green kappa. Magical dimension. And a red dragon archfiend. That's a cool one. That's a cool signer dragon. All right. Uh, what are we going to do? Ancient pro. No, no. Back to Star Server Drive. Then we'll do Ancient Prophecy. Got it. Got to whittle down these Star Server Drive as we go. There are a lot of great cards in here, though. So it's not like I'm like wanting to just get them out of the way. I just kind of want to even out the packs. You know what I mean? Relinquish Spider. Lovely. There's going to be a pretty long video because we have 50 packs to be open. Quick Draw Synchron. War of the Earth. Roar of the Earthbound. Not, not War. Spider Egg. Shine Palace. And wolf in sheep's clothing. Next up, ancient prophecy. Okay, this one definitely has one of those tags inside as well. Yep, there it is. We got another tag. One, two, three. Flippity flop, floppity flip. Give us a ghost rare when we open it up. We have Sunny Pixie, Boulder, Brain Research Lab, Battle Teleportation, the Divine Dragon, Aqua Bazaar, Pixie Ring, Core Reinforcement. An armored axon kicker. It's kicking the axon. Retro pack. You have literally been our only pull so far. So kind of brutal. So far, not off to a good start. But there are 50 packs for that reason. Just so we can pull something good. Harpy Lady. Twin Headed. Send you. Giant Germ. Luna Spark. Sonic Bird. Right Leg of the Forbidden One. I'm not. I don't think we're going to be completing Exodia in this one. With only like uh, five more packs. Hey, technically it could happen though. So I'm not going to completely rule it out. Oh, this is a first edition pack. Wait a second. I didn't know I had any first editions. That's a surprise first edition pack. Okay, we'll save that one for later, actually. I didn't know I had a first edition Stardust Overdrive. That's cool. That's certainly cool. Okay. It'll add a little bit of excitement to go along with the first edition Duels Genesis, the Turbo Packs. You know, I mean, there's some big stuff. Okay, I'm excited now. I'm really excited. Not that I wasn't already, but now I'm really excited. I want to pull something big today. Insect Neglect. Come on, Time Passage, Infernity Force, Slip Summon, Ritual Buster, Spiritual Forest, Ashaleon, Fortune Lady Dark. Okay, our first pull, Ultra Rare, Divine Grace, North Wimco. Okay, we've got, okay, second pull to Retro Pack, but even Retro Pack's not doing that good. That's our second foil. I'll take it. Oh, I already opened a first edition. I didn't notice that. Hey, there was a first dead quick draw in there. That's cool. All right, so that's good to notice. That's good to notice. Let's open a Labyrinth of Nightmare pack. We haven't done that yet. Labyrinth of Nightmare. Do not give us any nightmares. One, two, three, four. Can we get a Secret Rare Gemini Elf? Can we get Last Warrior from Another Planet? Dark Necrofear. The Masked Beast. Revival Jam. That would be good. Oh, Zombira. That's cool. I'm going to pull that out for goat format. Boneheimer. Oh, no. This monster wanders the seas, sucking dry any creatures it may encounter. You got to watch out the end from the Amazon. And a defusion. Okay. Heating up. That's two foils in a row. We're getting hot. Another super rare. Well, I guess another super rare. We had only had one before, but uh, we now have two. That's good. Stardust Overdrive. You, uh, you did give us the Divine Grace, so you are not doing terrible now. That's good. One, two, three. Can we flippity flop, floppity flip? I mean, any ghost rare in this would be amazing. I don't know what I just did. I think I put it to the front. There we go. That, that'll work. Spider web, relinquish spider, level eater, wolf in sheep's clothing, ritual of grace, bending destiny, earthbound way of the Lord British space fighter, and energy bravery. Retro pack. Give us something crazy. I just like cut myself with my finger now. That kind of hurt. Stab myself. Baby dragon, Joey Wheeler. We have Hop, Hoppy Lady, Mask of Darkness, Tune, Summon Skull, Black Illusion Ritual, watch out, Yook, Mystic Tomato, and the Time Wizard, Classic Joey Wheeler. I knew that if I spoke like myself, then I would to I just totally switched the accent. I would definitely pull the Time Wizard. I, I was, that was not right. Okay, but uh, the Joey accent, though it was terrible, did bring out the Time Wizard. So, hey, that's a win. We'll take it. Another A and P R. Can we get a little ancient fairy dragon action? I just uh, submitted an ancient fairy dragon to PSA earlier, so the hopefully, well, it was yesterday, but basically early. It was like it was like midnight, so it was kind of earlier. So hopefully that thing, it's an ultimate rare unlimited. Hopefully that thing will do well. It looked pretty clean. Quacky mirror and shark counter. I actually sent in a pretty awesome sub that I'm very excited about. That will probably be back in a couple months, you know. It's just the $15 level. Haven't actually done a submission in a little bit, so I'm excited to send that one in. I've been building up a few cards we've been pulling on the channel, getting from collections. A pointer, that used to be money. A pointer, he's pointing. Not so much anymore. We have Energy Bravery, Savage Coliseum, Attack Pheromones, Fortune Lady Water, and Herculean Power. The power of Hercules has returned. 
So far, no pulls out of turbo pack. It is a pretty rough one. Let's see the ratios on here. It is, uh, it doesn't tell you the ratios, but there's only four supers, one ultra, one ulti. So not a lot of high rarity. We have opened a 100 pack box of this before. So if you missed that, you can go watch that. It'll be on the screen. That was uh, one of our crazier openings for sure. I mean, that was that was pretty nuts. Bounce of Artemis. Gemini Spari adds a pretty good Edison card. And Zombie Master also not too bad either. Okay, not too bad for Turbo Pack 6. Now Retro Pack, these things open so nicely. It's very cool. Polymerization. Elegant Egotist, our ninja. Shh, watch out. 250K is here. Now you have to be quiet. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why, but Giant Germ. Time Wizard, Joey Wheeler, back-to-back -back Time Wizard, not too bad. We'll take it. Let's keep up the Stardust Overdrive. Haven't opened any Duelist Genesis yet. Just because, you know, it, the anticipation is like half the battle because most of the time you don't pull anything and then you're just like, ah, oh, dang, that sucked. But if you, you know, you're like, oh, there's still a chance there could be a Ghost Train there, you know, if you haven't opened it. And then when you actually open it and actually get it, then it's really all worth it. Slip Summon. Ritual Buster, Spiritual Forest, Regulus. Rinia and Infinity Necromancer. Um, let's do Retro Pack. Let's just go back to Retro Pack because I'm okay if we run out of those because they are newer. One, two, three, four. But they just bring out some really nostalgic old cards. And I really need more of these because these are awesome. The Sonic Bird, Toon Summon Skull, right, Gecky? I was I was saying rough for some reason, and I didn't know why. And I was like, I'll just go to the next card. I don't know what I'm saying. Maybe I was saying, trying to say Relinquished. Maybe I just knew there was going to be a Red Gecky. There's always this big print line, too, on the Red Geckies from Retro Pack. But I just spoke it into existence by accident. I wasn't even thinking about Red Gecky. So amazing ultra rare pull. I'll take that. I'm not mad about a Red Gecky. Can we continue the luck? Which has been okay so far. And just upgrade it, you know, just a little bit. From, like, pretty good to, like, incredible. How about that? Iron Core Armor. Gemini Counter, Gemini Booster, Energy Bravery, Savage Coliseum, Reptilian Gorgon, Stardust Angle, and Herculean Power, the power of Hercules. We're going to go back to back. No, 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 no. We're not going to go back to back. We're going to do Turbo Pack because we do have a lot of Turbo Pack. Turbo Pack 6 could contain the ultimate rare Dark Armed Dragon. Right now, we shall pull it. Right now, it shall be done. Right to the back. First foil. Transforming Sphere. This looks like a foil. Chain Disappearance, it is a foil. Okay, so we know they're unweighed. I mean, they're straight from Konami, so you'd think they would be. Super Rare Chain Disappearance, and that's probably a decent amount of money. Let's put up on the screen our total value we've pulled so far. The value of this whole opening is, it's a lot. It's over $1,000 for sure. So, you know, we're gonna try to make back some of that as we go, but I mean, that will help. Change experience, probably, I would guess, like $20 card, something like that. Not bad at all. I mean, that's definitely our best pull. One, two, three, four, in terms of value. Flame Swords, and we have Curse of Dragon, Magic Jammer, Jurai Gumbo, Mystical Space Typhoon, Mystic Tomato, Heels and Rux, and Special Into the Barrel Dragon. Okay, not too good. I'm so glad we just pulled that. That's actually pretty sick. Sardis Overdrive still has a bunch of packs to be open. If we could pull Archlor Christia, Ghost Rare, Majestic Star, especially in the first dead pack, because I've never pulled the first dead Majestic Star. That could be a big game changer right there. Spiritual Forest, Infernity Necromancer, Attack Pheromones, Tillian Viper, Infernity Force, Ritual Buster, Reptilian Poison, and Molting Escape. So yeah, we, we, we not great. And don't forget, guys, to check out the other videos from 250K Special, the 250K Special Week. If you're seeing this like later, then they're probably all out. If you're seeing this the day of, there will still be uh, other videos like before this. So you guys can go watch those if you missed them. Do not miss them, and don't forget to subscribe because we're making our way to 300k. <laughs> you know, we might as well start now. Legit in the Mystical Genie of the Lamp. Nice super rare. We're getting down low on the Stardust Overdrive. Still a bunch of Turbo Pack. Still all four Duelist Genesis. I'm just throwing that out there. All four Duelist Genesis. Still a lot of potential like a Ghost Rare, Ultimate Rare. First at Ulti Stardust, that would be okay with me too. I wouldn't be mad at all. I'd be, I'd be pumped. Spiderweb Level Eater. Quick Draw Sankron. Zero Gardener. Oh, I should have paused when I saw a Synchro. Black Brew Drago is actually a good Edison card. I think it's like 10, maybe even more dollars, unless it's had a reprint since then, but I don't think it has. That's a good pull. One of our best so far, actually. Okay, you know what time it is. It's turbo time. It's time to rev it up. Rev it up. I can't do that voice. You say voice slash 
Tristan voice. The I can do the only the OG Tristan. That's that's more my my uh, my speed. The OG Tristan is much much easier for me. Okay, transforming sphere, magical dimension, and the Elector Sovereign of Birds. Okay, he's a bird. He's a sovereign. Start us over, drive. We're getting to where we're gonna have to open one of these uh, Duelist Genesis packs. It looks like it's coming soon, very soon. Can we get something crazy to lead up into a molting escape? I need a little like hot streak so that I can start just like, yeah, we need to open it now. You know, it's going to trans transcend to the next opening. Swap frogs. Good card. Good card. Not what we're looking for. Um, we're going to do another turbo. I think we have like, so like eight of these or something. Maybe more. No spoilers in this pack. Can we get another foil? Green Kappa. Creature swap. Pretty nice go kart. Oh! What a fishboard blaster! Another super rare. I feel like we're getting lucky here. Two supers out of turbo pack. That's not bad at all. Creature swap green kappa. Also not too bad. Okay, I'm feeling pretty good about that. Uh, let's do let's do a duelist genesis. It's time. First edition. Here's the biggest pack we're opening because it could contain the first edition Ghost Star Stardust Dragon. And if that card gets a PSA 10, it's like five figures easily, like way over that. So. Yeah, that's it's a big time card. So let's see if we can do it. I mean, there's other great cards as well, like Charger Light Brigade, stuff like that. I'm I don't know what it is. I think it's probably flippity flop. We'll find out maybe eventually if we pull a foil. Hopefully, pull at least a foil out of four. Noisy Nat. <sighs> big, big pack. Sword of Kusanagi. Judgment of Thunder. Kremons is a great card. Medium piece golem. Jung Barrage. The Ghost Gun. Handcuffs Dragon and remote revenge nothing in that one nothing in that one okay back to ancient prophecy at the beginning still more packs don't worry there's still hope there's still hope guys don't give up hope yet okay do not give up hope we're gonna pull something cool release restraint wave dark sea float slip of fortune iron core luster major upset fishboard blaster damage translation reinforced truth and psychic soul okay Stardust Overdrive. Good old Stardust Overdrive returns us back to our roots. Not really our roots, but we have opened a lot of these uh, <laughs> recently. Okay, Spider Egg, Molting Escape, I'm running out. This is the last of what we have, so hopefully there is a Ghost Rare inside. Spider Spider, Dark Spider, we have Infernity Force, Mother Spider, and Spider Web, Spidery Pack, that's for sure. <sighs> Turbo Pack time. Turbo Pack time, hopefully you guys are enjoying a longer video. There are going to be some longer videos, mostly longer videos, actually, in this week. A lot of long videos, so have fun. Enjoy them while they last. Battleful Artemis, we have Transforming Sphere. Did we get... The Dark Arm Dragon! Oh, let's go! Oh my goodness! We got the ulti! Oh! real 14 random packs courtesy of konami shout out to konami they didn't send it to me they actually gave it away at a tournament but i bought them from somebody who got them unbelievable huge ultimate rare pull for 250,000 subscribers oh that is insane what a way to make this video Oh my goodness. And as for like grading things, it's a little off center. Whatever. Who cares? We got two super rares and the ulti in 14 packs. Unbelievable. That is a massive card. Ho ho ho. No. That is so sick. That is so sick. 250K. Let's go. Okay. So guys. I paused for a second and saw the ulti and I'm thinking, oh, there's more ultis. Like it could be the Dark Arm Dragon. Then I remember it. There's only one ulti in the set. <laughs> that is freaking insane. Now let's just pull a Ghost Rare. Let's just pull a Ghost Rare to go along with it. And this will be, I mean, it, it's already good enough. We don't really need anything. But look, I, I am not going to be mad if we pull something else, okay? That might have been my longest scream in a while. Like, it wasn't even a scream. It was more like a yell. I have not, we haven't pulled anything that big in a while, like for me at least. We've done some, had some big stuff in box breaks, which is still exciting, but like the, the horse, the horse was big. Okay, let's see what this is. Okay, 
The X Saber Garda Strike? I don't even remember this card. I have opened a lot of Ancient Prophecy, and I'm not sure we've ever pulled this. It's a secret rare. That's actually really, really good. I don't know the value of it. It's probably not crazy, but a secret rare from this Ancient Prophecy. So, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's keep it going. I think it's time. Remember when I said we needed a hot streak and I needed to, to open this? We just pulled Dark Arm Dragon Ulti and a secret rare from Ancient Prophecy. I'd qualify that as a hot streak. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'd qualify that as a hot streak. Let's see if this first edition duelist gen... If we pull the Stardust, Ghost Rare, first edition, and the dad in one in one opening, this is officially our best opening video ever. Like, I, I would even argue that could maybe top the LOB Blue Eyes just because of the ratios of this stuff. Like, well, though we did pull LOB Blue Eyes and Dark Magician, that's going to be hard to top. It would be close. Let me know in the comments. Would that beat the LOB Dark Magician, LOB Blue Eyes? Stardust Dragon, first set, Ghost Rare, plus ulti dad. Let me know. That'd be, it'd, have to, it'd be pretty close. Cobalt Hedgehog, Ghost Guard. Now, let's see. Let's just see if we can top it here. Psy Impulse, Destructotron, Gladiator Beast of Quest, Yamato no Kami, and... <laughs> okay, okay. This is not a huge card, but it is a first edition ulti out of the Duelist Genesis out of four packs. There is a little bit of a ding up there. The Dark Hunter. We can't be mad about pulling a first edition ulti. Like, sure, it's not the Ghost Rare, it's not a Stardust, it's not even a Synchro. That is still sick. This is what we are. We are three in a row. That is three straight pulls. I don't want to open this because the chances we actually pull something out of there are pretty low because we just pulled three foils out of there. So I'm trying to keep the hot streak alive. We do have to open the rest of those turbo packs though. I mean, there's still a lot of them left and like, it seems like they're absolutely cracked, like straight loaded. Four from the back on Labyrinth of the Nightmare. Can we keep this three pull streak alive? This is one heck of a video. Headless Knight, Garuda, Emperor's Holiday. I'm glad we're at least redeeming the MFC a little bit because that one didn't go that well. Lady of Salem, I'm a little bit. We're definitely redeeming it. Okay. Oh, four in a row. Destiny board! Destiny board! The final! The final from Labyrinth the Nightmare. That's four in a row. That's an ultra rare. So we went ulti, secret, ulti, ultra rare. When ultra rare is like the best rarity in this set. I mean, there's like one secret, so you can't really count that. Holy crap, we are on fire. Okay, the only way to really determine if we're actually on fire, if we pull something out of this, I mean, the ratios, you're only supposed to get like a foil every like 12 packs or something on these. Like it's something stupid. It might be a little bit easier on turbo pack, but it's still really hard. So getting three already, like we've definitely got our ratio. So we pull something else. Like, I don't even know what to say. Like we're just, we're just cracked. We're absolutely insane. Uh, we have Gemini Spark. I mean, if we pull anything else, Black Garden. Okay, sure. Yeah, sure. Whatever. I'm not mad. I can't be mad at anything at this point. Like this, this opening is crazy. We do still have a lot of turbo pack. Let's do back to back turbo pack. You know, let's why not. Here we go. I cannot believe we just did that. A dark arm dragon. An actual dark arm dragon. <laughs> I mean, we've pulled it before, but we opened an entire 100 pack box. So it's like you get one, like you just get one. So it was like cool, but it was like expected. And I spent a ton of money to get that. This was like a much lower, like less likely, uh, a, you know, thing. Armory arm, that's good. It was much less likely to happen. So uh, that's just insane. Okay, let's open this Stardust Overdrive because it's an unlim. And then we'll do another, uh, another turbo pack. If this first dead Stardust Overdrive over here goes crazy, we are just, we might need to go just go buy a lottery ticket. And by a lottery ticket, I mean just more Yu-Gi-Oh packs. Probably Magia packs. <laughs> Maybe some Magia packs, which, uh, yeah, hopefully we will get a little bit of luck with that. I don't know. We're supposed to do, I can't remember when in the week. I'm recording these kind of out of order. Sometimes, well, maybe I'm not. I'll have to look, but Mejia opening is happening this week. So I may or may not have pulled it or have pulled it. If I, well, I'm probably not going to, I'm probably not going to post it before this actually, just because, oh, I forgot what I was doing. I forgot. I couldn't spoil it. Okay. No, let's do Legacy of Darkness. We'll say, and then we'll do Duelist Genesis after that. Only one Legacy of Darkness pack. Let's see if it can come through with a secret rare. That'd be pretty awesome. What an opening, guys. One, two, three, four. I love pulling crazy stuff. So fun. Great wing. Nutrient Z. Warrior Die Greffer. Troop Dragon. Springer Rebirth. Bad Reaction to Smochi. Upside Down. Patrician of Darkness. And Susa. So I don't know. I just wasn't feeling that pack for some reason. We're down to only a few packs left. We'll do Turbo Pack. Then another Duelist Genesis. Let's not spoil this one. Though, I mean, the chances of two Dark Arm Dragons basically zero i think they're about one in 50 because we got two out of our hunter pack opening though i would not be mad to pull two i would not be mad at all green kappa out of artemis 
Another armory arm. That used to be a big money card as a rare. We'll see if it still is. Okay, first edition, uh, start the Duelist Genesis. Not Stardust Overdrive. That's Stardust Overdrive. Coming up next. Come on. Let's go. One, two, three from the back, right? Three from the back. Do a little bit of flippity flop, floppity flip. Side station. Come on. Silent Strider. Little Aragorn action. Beast of the Pharaoh. Light wave tuning. Dark the Dark Charmer. Gladiator Beast of Quest. Handcuffs Dragon. And an Oyster Meister, the Moister of Oyster. Okay. Turbo Pack, here we go. Turbo Pack Booster 6. Come on. Give us a little bit of luck. Give us that Dark Greffer. I think he's in here. Transforming Sphere. <laughs> Three Armory Arms in a row. I mean, I guess that's not too bad. What's our total value we've gotten back? Do we have a chance to make our money back with Dark Arm Dragon? I didn't even think about that. The guy who offers me like uh, like $800 for my Dark Arm Dragon PSA 9 every time. Who knows? Maybe I'll accept him now. He messages me like once a month. He'll probably message me for sure now. And then, hey, if we sell that other one, because I sold my PSA 9 from the other opening because we pulled it, I could replace it with this one because this one is more iconic because it came out of 14 packs. Who knows? Maybe we could do that. Okay, we're going to keep do one of every pack. Making our money back on an opening? Crazy. I never thought that would happen. All right, that does not happen often. Turbo Pack 6. I mean, if we pull another foil, that could help. That'd be pretty cool. We're going to get Armory Arm, Battle for Artemis. And the Sovereign of Birds, one of the most boring rares you can get, but that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. We've had plenty of good cards. Uh, I think that the least interesting left is Labyrinth of the Nightmare, just because it's unlimited. The others are first dead, or uh, can't be first dead, so they're basically first dead. The original packs or whatever. So here we go. One, two, three, four. Can we get another foil? These Labyrinth of the Nightmare have been kind of cracked. I'm not going to lie. We've pulled like two foils, haven't we? Soul Purity and Light, Deal of Phantom out of three packs. Wait, are we two for two? Just thought about that. Portrait Secret, okay. If we can get another one, Dream Sprite. <laughs> Revival Jam. Dude, these are absolutely loaded. All these packs in general, but Revival Jam is insane. That's a centered Revival Jam. That thing's getting graded. I just sent one off, like, yesterday or whatever. Yep, on limb. I'm still going to grade it because the first ad's like $600. So like this will be the affordable one at 200 or whatever it is. That is a nice card. Probably like five bucks, uh, you know, right now. But it w oh, wow, that man, I love the look of this card. It's so nice. Look at it. Look how it shines. Man, that's a sweet card. OK, still four packs left. Let's open the champion pack because I'm like 99 percent sure it's light, but I have to open them all just to figure it out because I got these from somewhere. And look, the chances that it's not just like one of the ones I've already opened and had his light packs. I mean, there, there was one guy that used to buy these from me. And then, of course, he would sell them as as unweighed. And I was like, great. Yeah, that's awesome. Book of Taiyu and Magical Dimension. Yeah, I was like, yeah, you could have said that when you were buying them. I was like, I'm telling you they're unweighed. You should probably tell me that you're selling them as as unweighed. No, I'm I'm selling them as weighed. Sorry. And he, and he should tell me he's selling them as unweighed. He didn't. So that's why I stopped selling those. I really only sell those to people I, like, I can trust not to do that. I'm going to do the turbo pack first because we've already kind of pulled everything you could pull out of here. Unless we get a dark grepper, that'd be pretty cool. Three packs left. Do not forget to subscribe for 300,000 because if you're enjoying the 250,000, I mean, 300,000 might just be even better because, I mean, 250, it's going to be hard to top this so far. But maybe it'll be better at 300. We don't know until we get there. Golem Dragon, Magical Dimension. And the Sovereign. I, I said it was the most boring. I should have known I was going to pull it again. Two first edition packs left. Let's try the Stardust Overdrive. Inside, we get Arch Lord Christia. We could get Ghost Rare, Ultimate Rare, all that different stuff. The Majestic Star, I've never pulled in first ed uh, Ghost Rare, so I would love to do that. I have pulled the first ed Ulti, though. We have pulled that before, so I wouldn't mind doing that again, though. Enlightenment, Reptilian Swaspawn, Savage Coliseum, the Tuned Magician, Spiritual Forest, Zero Gardener, and an Oshaleon, so another whiff on that first end. Leaving us with one final pack. If you guys have enjoyed the video, subscribe. Don't forget to check out Ruxon34.com and the other videos from this week of 250K. <sighs> first edition, Stardust Overdrive. Our last chance at the Stardust for now, for now. We've still not pulled in Ghost Ray ever, not even an Unlimited, so. I'm not feeling great. You know, it's a pretty hard card to pull, but if we can pull it, I will feel great. I will indeed. That Eater Beast of Quest, Psy Station, Silent Strider, Oyster Meister, Needlebug Nest, Medium Beast Golem, Telepathic Powers, Shield Warrior, and the final card of this video. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. I, I certainly have. And Tricky Spell 4, that's all right. We had some pretty amazing pulls in this. Go check out the videos on the screen because we have some big ones. 
previously and coming up for 250k. Shout out to Tone Info Show, Ernesto Dianda, America Deutscher, Brandon Cheney, Ian Moose, Junior Barding, Robert F, and Changalang. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time.